Good morning, this is Captain Mark Johnson from FloridaKeysFunFishing.com. I'm here with the guys from Salt Strong, and we are hanging out at one of my favorite places here in Ala Mirada, the Tackle Center, owned by a good friend of mine, Captain Donnie Lang, and we're gonna be in here today going over all kinds of cool products and tools and things that we use here every day in the Keys in the fishing business. So this morning, the first thing we're gonna start with is all the different types of jig heads we use for both inshore and offshore fishing. So as you look here on the wall, there's a big selection to choose from. So as the average fisherman comes in here and says, huh, what makes one jig head different from the other? So we talk about different things that jig heads do. You take a jig head like this, you can see it's got a wide gap hook in it. All right, they come in different weight sizes, which they all have labeled here, 16 8 quarter, 3 8 half. So the styles are pretty much the same. This is what we call a boxing glove head. And this is a black nickel wide gap hook. And that's probably one of the most popular designs we use. And you'll see on this particular jig head, it has what we call a worm keeper. Helps keep soft plastics on there a little bit tighter from lots of casting and fish pulling on it. They also work great with live shrimps and things. And then you'll also see you'll have a jig head like this for some of the guys who like a smaller hook pro profile and it doesn't really have quite the worm keeper you might see a little bit of a bump there all right so that's one very similar yet just a little bit subtle difference a smaller hook a different kind of hook as well as not having quite the worm keeper so when we fish a lot of live shrimps and things this jig head works fantastic with that you don't need the worm keeper so much when you fish soft plastics a lot the worm keeper comes in handy as far as wide gap worm hook me personally that's my favorite but sometimes you can get a much smaller hook profile same size weight we can make that layout there nice so that you can see the difference there so when you look on the wall, you see all kinds. You can buy them in bulk because we use them in, in high numbers. You can buy different colors. You can buy different sizes. And then you see one that looks really different. Believe it or not, look at how small that one is. And these are very common in the yellowtail world when you're fishing on the reef. So these little jig heads incorporate the lead just the same as a big one much smaller profile you can fish that with a strip of squid strip of ballyhoo strip of shrimp whatever you're using for a yellowtail and you free line that behind the boat and these are made locally here in florida and uh, it's become a very big hit for yellowtail fishing way past the days of just a hook and a split shot so just like that something simple as a jig head you can see a lot of the variations that they offer and again, all different sizes. So you can be fishing in a lot of current and fish a jig head, weighs a half ounce. You could be fishing the same area another day with no current, fish a jig head that weighs eighth of an ounce. You've got quarter, three eighths, and then you've got tiny ones. So you can cover a whole gamut of fishing using a jig head application based on just the weights alone. And again, favorite color, obviously chartreuse, because if it ain't chartreuse, it ain't no use, but you can get away with any color you want. Here in the Keys, one of the most sought after and well-known brand is the Hookup Lure. And this was done by Captain Hank Brown, bless his heart, he passed away a couple years ago. But this was the original big jig head in the Keys. And he makes the bucktails, the jig heads, and they come powder coated paint. They were done here locally. And now since on, this company has been sold and it's owned uh, by a different manufacturer up the state. But I got to give him a big shout out because in my own personal opinion, he makes the best jig head and the best bucktail quality with the powder coat paint that they do, the bucktail tie-in, and they are just fantastic. But as well as the Hank Brown, obviously there's all kinds of other manufacturers. You see a lot more commercial grade bucktails and you also have the commercial grade jig heads and not all jigs are created equal so you want to do your research you want to make sure they're tied right you want to make sure they have sharp hooked and as far as fancy eyeballs and colors that's all in just personal preference 
at the end of the day, almost all applications of fishing we do inshore and some of the stuff on the reef can be accommodated in full by all the different jig heads. And what I mean by difference is most important is not the color, as cool as they are, but it's the weight and the hook size. So again, you can fish quarter ounce, three eighths ounce, half ounce, whatever it takes to adjust to the depth and or the current you're fishing in. And that can take care of just about all your inshore needs, live bait, chunk bait, strip bait, as well as soft plastics. And so that keeps your tackle organization pretty simple and it maximizes your efficiency when you're out fishing with the family or a group of folks every day. For any other questions on jig head applications, you can always find Captain Mark, AKA Hollywood, on FloridaKeysFunFishing.com. And again, always on SaltStrong.com. And we're here at the Tackle Center, right in the heart of Ala Mirada. Whoa!